some days I really, really dislike walk, working off the farm. Today is definitely one of those days. So last night, as I was heading home from work, I talked to my husband and we had a meeting in town. So I was heading home to go pick him up to go back to town. And he said that he wasn't quite ready yet because he'd been dealing with lambs. Yes, lambs. The ewes I bought, they're lambing and I'm not there. So I didn't get to see him last night because when I got home, I picked him up and we headed back for town. I didn't see him this morning because I had to leave for work really early. So now I'm here at lunch and I still haven't seen him. So I really can't wait to get home. Had a set of twins and a set of triplets and he said there's one more that's possibly going to lamb before the day's over. So um, I got babies. The weather has changed. This afternoon when I went for lunch, it was 90 something degrees and gorgeous out. And now it's 70 something degrees and trying to rain. He just headed to go bail, said we had four more babies at the barn. So I'm gonna go change, um, put on long sleeves cause it's getting cold for me. And uh, let's go see my babies. I got two babies right here. I think this is the one that's kicking her side today when I was down here. That was, was uh, gonna have them. Lunch time when I said one was kicking her side. Yeah. Oh, she doesn't like the dog though. So there's two. Hi, sister. And then we go over to this side. And there's two more. And then. Hi. Two there and one up And what do you got? Daddy says you got one of each. Yes, hi. Got one boy, one girl. One boy, one girl. And you said that one had two boys and two a girl? Boys and, a girl. and the girl is not. Is not the, the black. black one because why would I get a colored lamb as a girl? <laughs> Just doesn't work in my world. It's a good mama. After the storm. Pretty good one here. You can kind of see a couple more over there. Boy and a girl for her. And a girl and a girl for her. So none of these ewes have names yet. Um, and I'm not sure what we're gonna name the lambs. They're either gonna be food for this year or they're going to be whatever the 2022 um, name theme is. We'll have to think on that. Three more in here. Her, her, and her that could potentially lamb anytime. And then there's a few that, you know, they look huge, like her. She looks humongous, but has no bags. So she could be just that much further off than the rest of them. And then there's some like her that have zero bag. So I think Aurora was marked She's got red on her. So I'll write her down. And Elm. Where'd she go? Right there. But those are the only two I'm seeing so far. Lucky, so. And they're the only two that are gonna get rebred. Um, like I said, they'll still stay in for another two weeks. And then, is that right? Yeah, another two weeks. And then we will Rotate everybody Because these lambs and moms need somewhere to go and <clears throat> And then I got another breeding group to come in So yeah, I got I, I need more room Are you happy you got babies again? Are you happy you got babies again? little tail yeah, you got babies again.
everybody's got feed and water. Hi, <laughs> I wish you were a girl. Hi, baby. No. <laughs> These guys. Yeah, good mamas. Good mamas. Where's your other baby? Oh, there she is. She's snoozing. Bad two days. We had two, four, six, eight, nine lambs in two days. And one, two, three, five girls, four boys. I'll take it. So that's a pretty good start to this lambing that we weren't expecting. But we knew they would come eventually when we bought these ewes. And um, just not disappointed. It's been a good day. This dog. We have a problem. Good boy, Hook. So who are we missing? We're just missing one more of your girls. There she is. No, not you. Yeah. <sighs> All right, let's separate these guys out. Oh, goodness. All back where they belong. One, two, three, four, five with Glenn. And one, two, three, four, five with Hook. Starlight's been remarked. So that's three. So one, two, and three. But it's okay. Yes, remarked is better than not bred at all. So I definitely get more anxious at breeding time um, than I probably need to. I, so like with this group over here that uh, all the rams have already covered the ewes, I know they've only been in there for a week, seven days, and they've all been covered. So in my mind, we should just throw them out in pasture with a cleanup ram and whatever happens, happens. But I know they, I, I know they need to stay for at least two cycles. But boy, I just wanna like push them on through. I wanna get Ace's group out. I wanna get these four groups out. I just, I wanna go, I wanna go. I wanna get the next group in and I wanna go. And I have to remind myself, slow down. Let everything happen that's supposed to happen. Let nature take its course in the way it needs to. And then everything will work out the way it needs to in the end. So hopefully in another week, we'll change the paint on the rams. And actually what I think I'm gonna do is put this ram in um, with, we'll open up those those pens and we'll put this ram in with all four groups, take those four boys, put them back out on pasture and let him be our cleanup for the second round. I think, we'll see. Like I said, I get, I get lots of ideas going on in my head and they sound really good, but then my husband brings me back to reality. But we got four ewes, nine babies, two more that could potentially lamb tomorrow, 
and everything's going the way it should go. some fly spray in the barn. Keep down the bugs. Look at that poor mama. Any day now, sister. You can just give me those babies. Yeah, I'm gonna keep my eye on her. She keeps circling and she's been pawing and she's pretty close. You are not close at all though. You're like a month out. Hey, doggies. You ready to go work? Huh? You ready to go work? Let's go. So last night, um, about 10 o'clock, we headed down and checked that ewe. And she had twins with her already. Um, we didn't put her in a jug because I wasn't 100% sure she was done. But looks like it's two girls. So let's go down and check her get her put away and see if there's any more lambs. Hi Casper. You watching your lambs? Hey. All right, let's see if there are, oh, one baby, two babies, three, four, five, six. Oh boy. Okay, six that I can see. Um, I'm kind of regretting not taking those two in last night. Because these lambs are spread everywhere. Oh boy, so here is one. And the one behind her. I'm guessing those two are a pair. To her. I think that is a single. And I believe this is a single. And then... I have one baby here and one baby over there. I think she is the one that lambed last night. So I believe this one and this one are hers. Which we would mean this single is definitely hers and that single is definitely hers. And those two twins, unless that one is a single for that one and that one's a single for that one. Okay. Um, I gotta go build some jugs. Hi, baby. Hi. Okay, I need to build some jugs. not quite prepared for this. We figured um, there would only be about six out of this group that we bought that would lamb. And let's see, four. So we're up to eight already and there's two more in there. One's trying to steal a lamb that was just born. And we have another one that keeps stretching like she's gonna lamb too. So I'm, uh, I'm very unprepared. We do have some red tags. We do have some blue tags. We need to get some of these out. And then I need my tattoo stuff. Which... Oh, 
Okay, so these two and the marking crayon or pen tattooer and and that should be all I need for right now. So on our tags, we're just going to write the mom's number. And since we decided we were going to just start at zero every year with a new color, rather than go up from the last year's last number with the new color, um, these guys, we already used a P for purple. These guys all came with pink tags. So we're going to use K for pink and then just put their number on it. And... We're gonna vaccinate lambs and moms. I'm guessing Panicure has to come from Valley View, don't it? Uh, yes, I believe so. Got somebody to get me? Yep. Yeah. Just tell me who you got. Got a boy first. And she's 108? 308. 308. Yeah, that black one wants that baby. So she ain't too far off. You may get your 10 after all. We're already up to what? Eight? I think so. That was my goal. We could have 10 to milk, and then we wouldn't be in too bad a shape. So basically, I put the girls in the wrong way. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so that they have a good hole for when their real yep. tag goes in. No. I know what he is. You know, I will say having this gate, this is a lamin pin actually. Actually kind of works. works. It does. Okay, so we need an E. Is that the right way or does it start on this end? Reads backwards. So it starts that end or the other end? I can't remember. Okay, and E blank. and then a blank. And then a zero. And then a zero. And then a one. Oops. Upside down. It's been a year. Everything has to... Rethink itself? Rethink itself. Hmm, that's gonna suck. I'm gonna be green. Okay. 
freaking flies. Mm -hmm. I'll spray again today. That, at least that other load. That's why we like laying them in the winter. Yeah, flies are pretty bad. Okay. Nope, didn't help. Okay, so we got this first one or that one? Doesn't matter. A little different number. One's gonna be a one and one's gonna be a two. E01 and E02. You're right. So it doesn't matter. You're right. Because it doesn't have to match anybody. We just have to know who nope. his mama was. Yep, so remind me to write all this stuff down here in a minute. Oh, come here, sister. You're really not gonna like this. Let's see, and we do it in this ear. <laughs> Get your back in a second, Mama. <laughs> Wore these pants last year. <laughs> yeah, you still got green on them from last year. So. <laughs> piercings in a day kind of sucks. Yep. Okay. But now you're done. You won't need any more. Except for an M and a scrapies. I'm sorry. So sorry. An M and a scrapies and maybe a piece of plastic in her tail. Oh, well. This might have to be the year. That'd be the way. Then we just go over to the barf ups from the Eagles. Scan them with our wand. <laughs> we know who the eagle ate. So morbidly <laughs> sad. So I came back to get the stand for my camera and she, I believe, is about to lamb. We're pretty darn close. Alright, well, we'll come back and check her in a little bit. 